guys, Buffalo here. Today we're out here shooting the Mossberg 930 tactical shotgun. It's a 12 gauge, uh, 18 and a half inch barrel on this gun. Cylinder bore all the way through, does not accept choke tubes. Uh, comes with a real nice set of LPA sights. It's got the fluorescent bead up front, the uh, aperture back here, and it is adjustable in the back for your windage and your elevation. Mounted on a Picatinny rail, and it comes, uh, comes new like this from the factory. It's got the oversized controls. It's real handy on a home defense style shotgun, easy to manipulate. Got the safety back here where you can operate it with your thumb, real easy to manipulate as well. Uh, it holds seven in the tube, has an extended tube on it, uh, one in the chamber. Just a real nice home defense gun. We're out here having some fun with it today. Hope y'all enjoy. That's what I'm talking about. Looks like I left a couple of them. Let's take care of them bad boys. Oh yeah. Let's see what some slugs do to this little barrel. You know what? Ladies first. I'm gonna pull Lisa out from behind the camera and let her shoot this thing. Now guys, earlier I mentioned that this thing has a capacity of eight, seven in the magazine tube, and one in the chamber. But this is one of those semi-automatics that's much like the Extrema 2 that I did a video on earlier that can be ghost loaded. I'm going to show you how to do that. I've already got my seven in the tube, so it's full. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull the action open and allow it to bring one out onto the gate. Bring the action forward just enough for that gate to lift up and slip another one in the magazine tube. All right, now I'm back to seven in the tube. What you're gonna do is you're gonna push down on this shell that's on the gate. Get him just right. This is easy to do once you've done it a few times. It can be a struggle at first. Put you another one in the chamber. Now you've got it loaded up with uh, nine rounds. You've got seven in the tube, one on the loading gate, and one in the chamber.
Now I will add my little disclaimer to this. This is fun on the range to run mine through it like that. But if I was keeping this gun for a self-defense gun or a home defense gun, I would just load it just like the like it was meant to be run, just like the Mossberg would have you load it. And that's seven in the tube and one in the chamber. All right, guys, in closing today, uh, we've had a ball shooting this little shotgun. I do want to mention that we had several uh, malfunctions. They were all with the cheap Walmart ammo in the 100-round uh, packs. We didn't have any malfunctions with the high-powered ammo and the slugs, stuff like that. Uh, I want to thank you all for watching. If you'd like to see Lisa Bell and more of my videos, click the like button below. Maybe we can get her out here a little more. See you all next week.